People who live in the Ogden Canyon area were today reporting strange sightings of large prehistoric looking creatures. Ogden police were investigating, so were the mayor, the council members, the professors from Weber State University. What did their investigation find? Ogden's new dinosaur park. Marianne Dunwell tells us now the dinosaur replicas on display are turning out to be a very big deal. They're big, all right. Ferocious and exact replicas of dinosaurs that roamed Utah 230 million years ago. You might expect Fred Flintstone to yell yabba dabba do, but instead, little boys yell. Whoa, look at that big dinosaur. Mitchell Heiner, who's four, joined special guests at the ribbon cutting of Ogden's new dinosaur park. You know what? That dinosaur right there is fighting that other dinosaur. Building the park took a small bite out of the city's budget, but the private sector paid for most of these prehistoric creatures. Look at those dinosaurs over there. And I see another dinosaur. That's a little dinosaur, though. 26 different dinosaurs stand frozen in time on the Ogden River Parkway. And there's a little teeny dinosaur, too. Oh, that one kind of looks like it's Triceratops. It is a Triceratops. It's for young people like Mitchell that these old timers were built. Plus, dinosaurs are really big these days. And dinosaurs are a very hot subject in our schools. And it's grown uh, in volume the last couple years. And the interest is high. And this year is the year of the dinosaur. The technology used in creating this Dionychus and over here this Stegosaurus and the other creatures here at the park is really no dinosaur. Designers use the latest state-of-the-art reproduction techniques. And they did lots of research in paleontology periodicals. Uh, typically we would go to three or four different issues and, um, and encyclopedias and some dinosaur books and things like that to get what we felt was the real true look of the dinosaur. And the critics seem to like the look. Uh, let's see, I have a stegosaurus at home. Do you, you saw a stegosaurus here? Yeah, and a triceratops. And did you see that here? Yeah. People behind this park say it may be the largest collection of dinosaur replicas in the country. It's a stegosaurus. So this prehistoric park could go down in history. Wow, look at that one. Wow is right. Marianne Dunwell, Fox News, Ogden. Yes, and Weber State University is going to run Ogden's new dinosaur park. Opens to the public on Saturday. Admission ranges from free to infants, 50 cents to a dollar for kids, $2 for seniors, and 250 for adults. <laughs>